Sort of wonder why No one said a word Don't you like it on the slide Don't you like it till it hurts Um 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 Through working with them I got to work with um Christopher Marie who's a makeup artist and Alicia Hurd and I mean they just drove like forty five minutes out here for nothing. They just did such a great job and everything. The looks were so it's like all on guard and it's just screen and you know, I wanted something that was different from what I thought was at the moment. Hello. Can you state your name? My name is Chelsea Donnelly. Okay. And your real name? My real name is Madeline. Okay. No. <laughs> I can't, I don't want people to know that. Well, I'm 22 years old. Um, I live in the United States from the United Kingdom. Um, I'm a professional full time fashion model and a part time photographer. How'd you get into modeling? I got into modeling at a very young age. My mom. I never really personally thought that I uh, was model material, but um, when I was living in Boston and going to school, I would get scouts a lot, and eventually I just you know, said, all right, I'll give it a try, and it just all exploded from there. One of my favorite photographers I've ever worked with was um, Joe Trina, and he was a photographer who took me without any portfolio, and he built my portfolio, and he taught me everything that I know to this day, and any shoot with him, I just, I value so much. I like it in the sense that I don't have to have an office job. You know, I have to work at the people, I don't have to work in retail. Um, and there's just not a lot of stress outside of modeling. But the negatives are, you know, you don't really have the greatest self image of yourself all the time. And the, um, there's, there's a lot of pressure, a lot of competition. And that's something that I've never really wanted in my life. I didn't want a job that I had to compete with other people for. But with modeling, it's just a constant competition. Um, my career as an actress has been a very great but um, fortunate experience and it is with very little acting in high school that was something I really had a passion for and um, Jody Scheifer for the Miller Production cast me for the lead female role in a movie called You Are Beautiful and from there it really just kind of, you know, the scale or kept going up and up and up and work was fine to me for a change. I didn't have to go out and look for it and, you know, I'm very grateful for it. And I think it, it comes down to the fact that I was so sure I was not going to get that part of the play that I wasn't nervous. But when I got it, <laughs> and then I was nervous, so then I tried not to be. <laughs> Do you think of uh, making a career out of being an actress? No, but you know, I wouldn't object to it. If that sort of thing go, that's, that's amazing. That'd be great. What do you think of the SCAT film department? I think it's, oh, if you can afford it, that is such a great opportunity. And, you know, from, you know, watching my roommate who is in the film department and film major. The thing she gets to do is just how much she's learned is just phenomenal. Uh, Madison is my roommate, first, or my best friend, first, my roommate as well. Madison and I met um, in Florida about three years ago. Three years ago. Um, I, went, I went to go see my friend Alyssa, and her and Alyssa were best friends at the time, so I met Madison. I, I can't really tolerate a lot of girls for very long before they start getting too girly for me, but Becca is just, you know, she's like hanging out with one of the guys, and she's really, really fun. Um, she single-handedly taught me that I didn't have to rely on somebody else to be who I am, that I could be independent, and that I was better off being independent. And before I was done with her, I was very dependent on just whoever was in my life, but from being with Becca, she, she taught me the way to appreciate everything I did and be happy with myself, and I truly feel that I'm that way now.
So what would your dream project be? Mine, Becca already knows, would be playing um, a similar Brad Pitt role. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or he's just crazy, but like, kind of like between Brad Pitt and, say, I met Madison quite a few months ago, and uh, we were just out, ran into each other, and had a lot of common, and started talking, and things started to blossom from there and work out. She's uh, very extremely straightforward. Uh, she speaks her mind, says what she thinks, and uh, if you don't like it, uh, fuck off, you know? That's kind of, you know, but she, uh, she's a wonderful girl, very sweet, very friendly but uh, doesn't take shit from anybody. Uh, it's completely immaculate. It's uh, spot on, you know. She, she does extremely good work. And uh, she does extremely good work. Everything she touches is fucking gold. Personally, I think I'm at that. I think I'm funny in that like, quirky and weirdo sort of way, but uh, I don't particularly sound like what some people just feel that. I think that I've worked with photographers who have made me, or made that image look beautiful. I've always been kind of the uh, outcast here or there, but modeling has enabled me to meet, like, some amazing people. Like, the other models, that's all the top of my head, terrorized Juliana Cole, like, they're just these beautiful, talented people, and I'm so honored that I've had the chance to work with them and meet them. And the photographers I've met, I would never have changed any of it. And I don't think it's really separating me, because I think I've always been separated for one reason or another. No matter where I am, no matter what I'm doing, I'm always going to be doing a photo shoot here and there. And it's always going to be part of my life. Just for already when I'm old and wrinkly, I'll probably be like old lady magazines. Get straight, wait here while I try to find the exit sign. When will you stop asking strangers? No one wants what we want. Keep one eye on the door, keep one eye on the back. Never expect to be sure. You're working for the police and the private, the pirates and the pilots, fingerprints and waiting. Dresser, felt up and fingerprinted, waiting for the train. Lord, Lord, mother, we are all losing love. Lord, listen, love, we are all missing mama. Lord, Lord, mother, we are all losing love. Lord, listen, love, we are all missing something. Oh,